Hi, my name is Karthik from Design School by WPA Algorithms. In this video, I want to list out six best free Elementor add-ons or add-on plugins that will really take your Elementor free or pro version to the next level. These are not just any other add-ons, but these are add-ons that will enhance your experience and add a lot of value to your Elementor page builder. Let's get into it. Now, the first one on my list is Oh Boys. Elementor steroids. I've made a separate video on this add-on, but I really want to talk about this add-on. Now, the really cool thing about this free add-on is that you don't get any widget in Elementor, but rather it enhances each and every widget in your Elementor. It's that simple. So, for instance, if I click on heading widget, you find an extension called Harakiri. So, this will let you get a vertical text just with click of a button. You can also choose to flip it just like that. You can also adjust the height. See that? It's really cool. And not just that. Also in your search form, I'll just click on my search form and there's a brand new feature in Oboys Elementor Steroids called Search Cop. And that'll let you choose what you want to show in the search results. So if you just want to show posts when users search for a query you can do that you can show pages you can show products or basically any other custom post types which is really awesome these are the things that really take elementor to the next level and not just these there are ton of functions in the steroids for elementor so if i hover over settings click on steroids for elementor you can see there are ton of extensions, but they don't add a single widget to Elementor. And this is a game changer. I don't know why people aren't using this. It has over 10 million, 10,000 installs on WordPress repo. You should definitely check out Elementor Steroids by oh boy, It's really good. Now moving on to the second one. The second free add-on, this one is really huge, is Happy Add-ons for Elementor. Now, the cool thing about happy add-ons is that it has its own dashboard entry so i can simply click on happy add-ons and the free version itself adds a ton of widgets now notably the things which are important are the table widget the team member widget the pricing table widget which is usually found in elementor pro also the review widget again this is also found in elementor pro but using happy add-ons, you get this widget for free. And the most important, important add-ons in happy add-ons package are the social share widget, which is actually found in Elementor Pro. Again, it's available in the free happy add-ons version and you can customize each and every aspect of your add-on or your widget. You also have your icon widget. You also have your Twitter feed widget. And you also have your table widget. Now, this is really great. And it's a great way to add Elementor tables without installing any other plugins or any other third party add ons. Now, since this works natively with Elementor, this is a game changer. Again, Happy Add ons is really cool. And not just the widgets, it also has few neat tricks of its own. So you can enhance most of the widgets. Just click on any widget under Advanced tab. You can see something called Floating Effects. So you can achieve this floating effect using happy add-ons. You can just toggle this on and have these neat little effects playing into action, the combination of effects. Without writing a single piece of code, you're able to apply CSS animations just like that. You can also do CSS transforms. You can skew the image like that. Totally awesome. And all of this is in the free version of happy add-ons. Definitely should check out Happy Add-ons. That's the second one on my list. Now, the third one on my list is called Master Add-ons. Now, a lot of people have been asking me how to do custom CSS on Elementor free version. Well, it's quite simple. All you need is add-on called Master Add-on. Now, don't worry, I'll leave links to everything in the description. As of now, I've deactivated Elementor Pro on this website. And when I click on any section, column or a widget and go to Advanced tab, you can see there's a field called custom CSS. So you can simply use it to target the column. So if I say on hover, 
maybe I'll change the background to blue or something. Just like that. So you can put any custom CSS into this field using element of free version. I, I think this is only found in master add-ons, free version, but not any other add-ons. But this is a great addition for those of you who are looking to implement custom CSS natively using Elementor interface. Now the fourth plugin on my list is called Jet Widgets. Again, I made a separate video on it. The reason for Jet Widgets is that it has few new, few neat widgets that actually come with Elementor Pro. So for instance, this images layout widget is nothing but the Pro Gallery widget. So you can pick images and adjust the layout of the whole gallery, which is really neat. So I'll remove all of the other images. I'll just clone this. And under settings, you can choose grid, masonry, justify, or basically pretty much anything else. Again, this is Pro Gallery widget, which is found in Elementor Pro. But with Jet widgets, you can get it for free. By the way, Jet widgets is by the folks who built Croc Clock. So it's pretty standard. It has got over 10,000 installs. It works pretty great. If you're looking for a gallery widget that works natively with Elementor and few other widgets, maybe you can try out Jet widgets. The fifth plugin on my list is called Anywhere Elementor. So you can search for Anywhere Elementor and it's this one. I'll try to leave links to everything in the description or you can simply search WordPress repo and you'll find it. Not a big deal. It's by WP Vibes. So once you install this plugin, now, if you don't have the pro version of Elementor, and if you go to any of the templates, you don't have the short code field. The short code field is exclusive to Elementor free version. But what if you want an Elementor template with a short code so that you can embed it anywhere? Well, once you install Anywhere Elementor Pro, you get short codes for Elementor templates. You create templates like you would do with normal Elementor templates. And this is one of the templates created as Anywhere Elementor template. Now this is the design totally customizable with Elementor and that's really neat. Now you can also see that there's a short code for this template. Since we created it with Element Anywhere Elementor add-on, it has a short code even though I don't have the pro version of Elementor. I can simply copy the short code. Now the short code can be used anywhere across your WordPress website, wherever there can be text, there can be your short code. So I'll just drag in short code widget. I'll paste the short code. And just like that, the page or the template is embedded without me having to do a thing. Just like that, all because of anywhere elementals. So if you want short codes in your templates, maybe you're reusing your templates or embedding them. Anywhere Elementor is the add-on that you should get. Again, it's free. Now, the last one on my list is Envato Elements. For those of you who are just getting started with web design, or if you're absolutely new to WordPress, this is a game changer for you. It has templates for almost any kinds of websites. And some of the templates may require the pro widgets of Elementor, but most of them will work with the free version as well. Plus, you get to explore how different types of sections, different columns can be designed. So, Envato Elements, just install and activate it. And once you do, you can find a ton of templates. So, once you install Envato Elements, in every Elementor interface, you find this Envato logo. And when you click on it, there are tons of premium kits. And you can see that there's a template literally for any sort of website. And they're countless. And even better, if you're an Envato Elements member like me, you can get access to the premium templates. The only downside for Envato Elements is that sometimes it adds unnecessary custom CSS to the theme, which I don't really like. I wish they did it natively using Elementor itself. But anyway, this is just a great way to get started. As you can see, there's literally a template kit for any sort of website that you want. So that's my top six plugin list for Elementor. There are a lot of other plugins that do a lot of other stuff, but I think these six plugins will change the way you work with Elementor and actually enhance your Elementor experience. That's it for now. Let me know what you guys think 
in the comments down below and catch you in the next one until then peace Thank you.